Hi everybody, welcome to Sacred Body Studio. My name is Fabi. So are you ready to start your nice yoga at home? Just to feel good. So we're going to start just having a couple of breaths. You can be sitting or you can be lying. And just concentrate on your breath. We take a deep breath through the nose. And exhale. Relax your shoulder, relax your face. Again, inhale. And exhale. Now try to be aware of the pause between inhalation and exhalation and just hold it a little bit longer. So inhale and exhale. Try to relax your shoulders, your face. And again, inhale and exhale. During the class, we try to keep a deep, long breath and we try to keep it calm. So let's start. We're going to start lying on our tummy. So we're going to start to release our spine and our neck. So we're going to lie down on the tummy. And we're going to bring the arms beside you, body pulse facing down, and let the face rest onto one side. And we're just going to hold here. And very gently, we're going to press the hips on the ground to feel how your lower back extend. We're going to hold here for four deep breaths. Ready? And try to keep that gently sensation of press the hips against the floor. Let's go for four. Inhale deep. And exhale through your nose. Relax your shoulders. And again, inhale for three. And exhale. Let's go two. Exhale. We feel the release in our neck. And just one more, inhale, and exhale. Now we move our face opposite direction. And remember that gentle sensation of press your hips against the ground to extend your lower back. We hold for four breaths, inhale, and exhale. Be aware of your spine position. Let's go for a three, inhale, and exhale. Let's go for two, and exhale, and just one more, and exhale. Bring your hands close to your chest, push your body up onto all fours, and we go all the way onto child pose remember push your bum down onto your heels but your bum cannot go too low bend your elbows and press your hands against the ground to keep pushing your bum down against you or towards to your heels bring chin and chest to release your neck and very subtle and gently we press the front of the feet against the ground and feel how your leg muscles and your tummy muscles engage we're gonna hold here for four breaths inhale if you feel comfortable, you can extend fully your arms forward. Let's go for three. Inhale. And exhale. Let's go for two. And exhale. And just one more. Inhale. And exhale. Back onto all fours, open your knees in the same width of your hips. Let's go on to cat and cow. So we just go inhale, cat stretch, and exhale, cow stretch. Arching your back by stretching your tummy. Let's go for three, inhale, cat, and exhale, cow stretch. Let's go for the last two, inhale, cat. And exhale, feel nice sensation in your back and your shoulders. And just one more. Inhale. And exhale. Back into new, onto neutral, bring your elbows onto the ground. Lie on your tummy one more time. This time we're going to bend the arms and we're going to make a pillow for the head. Rest the face in one direction. And if you are resting your face, on your left side, so you are looking towards to the right side. We're gonna bend the right leg and we're gonna bring the right leg as closer as we can towards to our arm. And we're just gonna hold here. 
Rest in here for four breaths. Feel a nice sensation at the back of your hips and, of course, your leg. Let's go for four. Inhale. And exhale. Anytime you can close your eyes and completely feel your body. Let's go for three. Inhale. And exhale. Let's go for two. Inhale. And exhale. And just one more. Inhale. And exhale. We're going to swap. So we just move our face towards to your left. We bend the left leg. We rest our head in our hands. And we just hold it here for four breaths. Inhale deep. And exhale. Let's go for three more. Inhale. And exhale. Let's go for two. And exhale. Releasing you. Lower back. And just one more. Inhale. And exhale. We release. Bring your hands close to your chest. Push your body up one more time on two all fours. Let's go on to cat and cow. So we go inhale cat and exhale cow. Releasing your spine. Let's go for the three and exhale. Two inhale and exhale. And one more. Inhale. And exhale. Back into neutral. We keep the index fingers pointing forward. Spread the fingers on the ground. Press with your hands. Try to don't let the um, fingers stay flat. Try to kind of feel a sensation of grip in the ground. Curl the toes under. Lift the knees. We go into downward dog. So we move our bum all the way up towards the ceiling. And we're just going to go inhale, lift your heels off the ground, and exhale, bring your heels down. We're going to repeat for three more. Inhale, come up, keep your tummy engaged. Exhale, down. Let's go for two. And down. And just one more. And down. Slowly bring your knees onto the floor. Bring your elbows back onto the ground. And here, you can keep your shoulders above your elbows, but if you feel it's too much tension and stress in your lower back, you can always bring your hands forward so your chest go lower, or you can open your elbows just beside your shoulders. So then it helps you to don't put too much on the pressure the lower back. But if you feel comfortable in this position, it's okay. Remember, just stretch as far as you feel good, that there is no pain involved. Now from here, we press with the feet so we can engage the leg muscles to support us to go into the back bends. We're going to go inhale to prepare, exhale, push through your fingertips, lift your elbow, extend your tummy. And we go again, inhale slowly, bend your elbows and go down. And again, exhale, push through your fingertips, lift your elbows, chest come up and release down. If you have your elbows a little bit wider, your chest might be on the floor, but it's going to be the same. Inhale, exhale, extend your arms, lift the elbows, and inhale, release down. Good. Let's go for two. Exhale, whatever position you have, and release. Just one more. Feel lovely stretching your tummy, and release down. Bring your hands back into your chest, beside your chest, push your body up, come on to all fours, curl the toes under, downward dog. We go inhale, heels up, exhale, heels down. Let's go for three and down, two, down, and just one more, and down. Bring your knees back again onto the floor. Slide the right knee forward, close to your right hand, and the left one backwards. Come onto your fingertips to elevate more your chest. 
Press with your feet against the ground to stretch more your tummy. Lift the chest and your face. We hold for four breaths. Pressing your feet against the ground to really feel more support and, of course, engagement of the legs and the core muscles. Hold me here for three more breaths. Inhale. And exhale. Let's go for three. And exhale. Let's go two. And just one more. Hands back onto the ground. Press yourself again onto all fours. Back onto downward dog. And we go. Inhale, lift your heels up. Exhale, bring them down without forcing your body. And let's go for three. And down. Two. And down. Just one more. And down. Slowly bring your knees onto the ground and slide the left knee forward, the right backwards. Extend your arms as much as you can. Come onto your fingertips to help us to elongate the tummy. Press with your feet to feel that deep stretch in your tummy. Relax your shoulder. Let's go for four breaths. Inhale deep. And exhale. Let's go for three. And exhale. Let's go two. And just one more. Release your hands onto the floor. Push yourself one more time onto all fours. And let's go onto downward dog. Let's go one more time. Inhale, heels up. Exhale, heels down. Let's go for four. And release. Let's go three. Down. Two. Down. And just one more. Down. Slowly bring your knees onto the ground. Bring your elbows back onto the floor. Lie on your tummy. And we're going to repeat the back bend. So ready? Let's go. Inhale. Exhale. Press to your fingertips. Lift your elbows. Extend your arms, stretch your tummy. You can also open your elbows wider if you prefer. So ready, inhale and exhale. Come up. Inhale, release down. Let's go for two more. Inhale, exhale. Press with your feet to elongate your thighs and engage your tummy. And release. And just one more. Come up. And release. Let's come back to the leg position. So bend your arms. Let the face rest on your hands. And bend the right leg. Bring it as closer as you can to your elbow. We hold here for four breaths. Be very aware of the areas you are releasing when you are holding the stretches. Let's go for four. And exhale. Let's go for three. And exhale. Two, and exhale, and just one more, and exhale. We swap the legs, we just go other side, I feel nice sensation in this position. We hold here for four breaths, inhale deep, and exhale, let's go for three. And exhale. Let's go two. Exhale. And just one more. And exhale. Release. Bring your legs together. Hands come just beside your chest, your thumbs under your nipples. And extend your arms. Lift your tummy, arching your back. Give me your knees on the ground. Don't worry, your hips come off the ground. Just concentrate and stretch your tummy. Relax your shoulders down. Take a deep breath here. Inhale. Exhale. Back onto all fours. Sitting all the way back onto child pose. Again, if we are not going all the way down. We just help us to push ourselves down. And we just hold here for four breaths. Inhale deep. And exhale. Let's go for three. 
And just one more. We come all the way on two all fours. We sit down on our bum. Bring your legs to the front. Bring your arms forward. And we're just going to tilt backwards. Make sure that you have room enough. You tilt backwards and you just feel the tension in your tummy. We're going to hold here just for four breaths. Inhale. And exhale. Let's go for three. Exhale, two, exhale, and just one more, exhale, extend your arms, raise your torso, reaching up, if you need to bend the legs to straight fully, your back, go ahead, don't keep your legs straight with the back curving, it will help you, so try to bend your knees if you need it, super, now from here we're going to bend the left leg, Pull it towards to you, and then we're just going to drop it to the side. If you feel pain on your knee, on your hip, when the knee goes down, or your knee is way too higher than your hip, you can always use a block or a cushion or a pillow, but make sure that you don't have pain either in your knee or your hip. If you don't need it, it's okay. Now we're going to bring the arms to the front, and we're going to fall forward. If we cannot hold the foot or we cannot bring the chest close to the thigh, we're just going to bend the leg. Doesn't matter if you bend the leg, you're still extending the hamstrings, the back of your leg, and you're still developing flexibility, but it won't put on the pressure of your hamstrings. So just hold here. If you can extend the leg fully, fantastic, but if not, we keep it a bend. If we don't feel comfortable holding the foot, we just keep your hands on the ground. And we hold here for four breaths. Inhale and exhale. Let's go for three, two, and just one more. Raise your torso, and this time we're going to twist towards to your left side. Keep the right hand just beside your thigh, and we just try to lean towards to the leg. One more time, if you feel too tense here and you don't have too much mobility, bend the knee. Just concentrate more in what is happening in your torso, in your waist, in your back muscles. And we hold here for four. Inhale. And exhale. Feel nice sensation on your waist. Let's go for three. Two. And just one more. Come all the way. Release. We're going to bring the legs together. We're going to tilt backwards again for four breaths. So we hold for four. Exhale. Feeling the tension in your tummy. Let's go for three. Two. And just one more. Push your pelvis forward. Extend your arms. You can keep your legs straight or bent if you need it to completely elongate your spine. And release. Now we're going to bend the right leg. We pull it close to us, as close as we can, and we drop it. And one more time, if you feel tension in your knee or pain in your knee or your hips, just place something under the thigh and that will help you to... Don't put on the pressure of your joints. Never feel pain or stretches around your joint area because that might hurt your ligaments or your tendons. Let's go forward. So again, if I am like that, I cannot go too low. Bending the knees will help us to not only to hinge, but to release more our muscles without putting on the pressure, or putting on the tension that might hurt. So we hold here. We can hold the foot or we can just keep your hands onto the ground. Let the chest go down, relax your shoulders, and we hold here for four. Inhale deep, and exhale. Let's go for three, and exhale. Let's go two, exhale. 
And just one more. Feel nice sensation always when you are stretching. If you feel pain, if you feel too much tension, bend your knees, make so, do something to can help you to don't stress your body and relax your body. That's what we really want. Let's twist. So this time is your left hand, go towards to you, right thigh. The other one above your head, we twist towards to the right side. We go as far as we can go. If we cannot go too low, we bend the leg. And we just extend our arm. We hold here. Feel nice sensation on your waist this time on your right side. Let's go for four. And exhale. Let's go for three. Two. And just one more. Come all the way up. Bring your legs to the front. We tilt backwards, again, to feel your tummy muscles, just for four breaths. Let's go. Four. And exhale. Let's go for three. And exhale. Let's go two. And exhale. And just one more. You really feel your tummy. And there, if you are shaking, it's a okay. case. Just building up strength. Straight your arms. Here you can bend the legs as much as you need it to really stretch your back. Elongate your spine. Take a deep breath. Inhale. Be careful that the knees don't go wider. And exhale. We lean forward. But I really need that you keep your chest close to your thighs. Doesn't matter you bend the legs. Don't stretch forward bends like this because it's only pull your hamstrings. So give it time to your body to build up uh, flexibility. So bend your knees and really feel the chest touching your thighs. You can keep your hands on the ground or you can catch your feet. And just push your feet forward. Let the chest come close to your thighs. Let the head drop down. We're going to hold here for four breaths. But what I wanted to do is that you flex the right foot and swap. You, flex, you point the right one, sorry, and you flex the left one. And then you just swap to release your legs without pain. So let's go for four breaths. Inhale deep. And exhale. Relax your shoulders. Let's go for three. Legs. It doesn't matter if I am very high here. I'm still working my legs, releasing my body. Depends on my mobility. Well, I don't put, don't put your body under pressure. And the last one. Well done. Raise your torso one more time. Straighten your back. Reach up and drop your hands. Bend your legs. Cross your legs. How you feel? Let me know in your comments. Don't forget to like, subscribe. And follow us in Instagram as a Sacred Body Studio. Thank you to join us. I hope you feel good. And we we'll see you soon. Namaste.